here we are. We're talking with our neighbors, Ben and Catherine. And who's this little guy? Oliver. Oliver. And how old are you, Oliver? Seven. Seven. Good boys. And who's this pretty little girl? Five. You're five? She's five. And you're Faye? And we're Harry. He's taking a nap. Time change got us. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Harry's almost two. Okay. Gosh. I still don't think of him as almost two. So, um, now you guys were originally from Louisville. Yes. And then, but you didn't meet here. Well, yeah, no, we both both grew up kind of east end of Louisville, but really connected in New York City. And what were you guys, what were you doing in New York? So I lived in New York for about 12 years, and most of the time was working for kind of a media measurement firm, which is what I do now, work for Nielsen Ratings Company. And you? Yep, marketing sales in New York for about 10 years. Met there. Had two kids. These two guys were born in New York City. Yep. And then when Faye was born, we decided we needed some more space and family around and decided to make the move back to Louisville. So what made you choose this neighborhood? Well, we wanted, wanted, wanted kind of an urban transition. You know, we weren't going to go right into... McMansions in the suburbs. Mm -hmm. uh, so, was pretty keen on the Highlands, but found this house here in Crescent Hill, and uh, it's been awesome. I think one thing that was important to us was just being having the walkability, being able to walk to Blue Dog to get a cup of coffee, and um, I love that we can walk to the library a couple blocks away. We do story time there all the time. There were a lot of kids in the neighborhood that we, we were really drawn to that. Um, there's a little playground a street away, which we go and play and swing on their swing. So I think just kind of the, the walkability, not having to get in the car to go everywhere, is something that we were drawn to. Yeah, for sure. One thing I notice and I just love is that you guys are out in the front of the house a lot. <laughs> you well, know, I think we're lucky and this street is so great because we have this court here um, and it allows us to kind of play outside and we've got kids down the street that, that are constantly kind of coming by the house and our kids love to scooter and ride their bikes and um, I think having the court here lets us do that without a lot of traffic and so it's kind of the perfect location on the street. Yeah. Well, and in, in so many neighborhoods and kids are just in their backyards. I mean, I know right. you guys have a fenced yard. It's very private. You have your all your toys and, yeah. you know, swing sets and all that stuff back there. But you guys are out here all the time. And, and I just love it because, you know, my kids are grown now, so I don't... Yeah. I think we're just, we're social. We like to see other people. I mean, if we go in our backyard, it's kind of just us. And right. we love that we can come out here and you know, talk to Joe, he comes out of his house, or the chances are around in you guys, and I think it's just nice because we can socialize too. And yeah, and being on, on the interior of this little island here allows for the scootering, bike riding, we play basketball here, obviously, so. Well, our, our kids learn to, well, the youngest one learned to ride her bike yeah. right on, on this area too, are which which was great. We love this neighborhood, yeah. I mean, we are so happy, we love the fact that we can walk to bars and restaurants when we have a chance to go out. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> yeah, there's good, like, we've got some babysitters in the neighborhood, so. Yeah, you know. lots of friends and, you know, family in the area, which is, yeah. is huge. And that was a big part of us coming back to Louisville. Family. Um, and, uh, but yeah, Crescent Hill's been been awesome. Twice a week we're eating Blue Dog for lunch. Oh. <laughs> yes. yes. Blue Dog is the best bakery in Louisville, oh. hands down. Oh, yeah. I hate Mondays when it's closed. Um, yeah, we go to Craft House a lot. That's yep. probably yeah. become our go-to place to eat. And Red Hog. Oh, gosh. Spot. I know it. I know it. Have been there yet? No, we are. I cannot wait. Yeah, it's really good. It's really can... good. Cool scene. They just got their outdoor seating. Yeah. Well, a lot. It seems like every other month a Something's new awesome up. place yeah. opens up yeah. down the street. The cool thing about Frankfurt Avenue in this area is that you know you kind of get the diversity. Well yeah the diversity but the, the, the bars, the restaurants, the coffee shops. I mean, there's a little bit more in the Highlands but you have it here kind of without the congestion and the parking nightmares and so the Highlands is cool but this is sort of a microcosm of that that's a little more accessible and and uh, yeah, it's just family friendly yeah, for sure. It's just kind of, it's kind of perfect for us. 
Okay. Well, thanks so much, guys. Hey, thank you. Okay. Say bye, Say bye to the camera. <laughs>